London has almost a dozen of football player statues, but one of them stands out, not only because of its beauty, but also because of the very interesting stories behind the player. Goalkeeper San Bartrand spent his entire career at Charlton Athletic from 1934 to 1956. His importance to the team rendered him a statue at the Valley and a very special spot in the club's museum. In 1947, he helped the team to win the FA Cup and he still holds the record for the number of appearances with 623 matches for the London club. Sam Bartram is our most famous player, that's why he has a statue outside the ground. He's still the record holder for having made the most appearances for the club, over 600 appearances. And that would have been even more if the, all the appearances he made during World War II, which don't count, were included. So he probably pl actually played for the club over 800 times. In a very iconic episode in 1937, Charlton played Chelsea at Stamford Bridge. Fogg made the referee void the match. However, no one told Bartram. He was left out on the pitch to defend against an opponent who had since long departed. It was a very foggy day. London was notoriously famous for having very bad fogs because of all the pollution then. And that day it was particularly foggy. And the game was called off. Um, but a policeman was walking around the ground uh, after all the crowd and the players had left and saw that Sam Barton was still standing in goal. No one had told him. He hadn't heard any, anyone tell him that the game was off. And he just thought Charlton was doing really, really well and attacking the lot. And that's why he hadn't seen anyone for 15 minutes. This story became a meme on the internet, but it's not Bartram in the picture. This actually shows Arsenal's Jack Kelsey during a fog match in '54, and he was not left behind. The photo you quite often see is actually a, uh, a goalkeeper called Kelsey. He, you're right, he played for Arsenal. It just happens to be a, a photo of a, a goalkeeper. But if you look at it closely, it's, it's not Sam Bartram. You can see the hair is different. So Sam had you know, very bright red hair, and even though it's a black and white picture, you can see that that's not him. In another curious story that shows his commitment to the club, Bartram left his own wedding earlier to play in a home match. Sam got married very close to the valley, the, the Charlton's home ground, um, uh, in the morning, on Saturday morning, uh, and then he left the reception and came here to play the, for Charlton in the afternoon, and then went off on his honeymoon. It's undeniable that Bartram is a great character in Charlton's history, and almost 40 years after his death, fans still honour the unique goalkeeper. Everyone who knows anything about the history of Charlton knows about Sam Bartram. Uh, even to this day, there's a song that the, the fans sing with his name in it. So. It talks about um, Sam Bartram, do you miss it? He won the FA Cup.